Hey Church, it is great to be with you today. I hope you've been enjoying this week's devotions for the start of 2023. If you've missed out on any at all, make sure you head back online and check them out because they have been fantastic, setting us up for an incredible 2023. And today I'm just going to share with you and remind you about the power of the supernatural in our lives. I just want to share a verse from Ephesians 1 to start us off and it says in verse 18 I pray that the eyes of your heart may be enlightened in order that you may know the hope to which he has called you the riches of his glorious inheritance in his holy people and his incomparably great power for us who believe that power is the same as the mighty strength he exerted when he raised Christ from the dead and seated him at his right hand in the heavenly realms, far above all rule and authority, power and dominion. What excites me about that is that the very same power that raised Christ from the dead is still alive and operating in you and I today. And our prayer for you this year, church, is that you would believe and that you would access and operate in the supernatural power of God. In Acts 1 verse 8, it says you will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you and you will be my witnesses. You know, the thing that I love about the book of Acts, it's one of my favourite books in the Bible is because there's just countless times where just the power of God is just working through ordinary men and women like you. And that same power is still in operation today in you and I. It's still as true for us today as it was for the early church in Acts. This power is not exclusive. It's not for the elite. It's not for the VIPs. It's for those that have chose to partner with the Holy Spirit, for those that believe that he can still do the impossible through you and through I. And all it requires is our obedience. You know, for Joel and I, we've got so many stories of where we've had our natural and that where we've allowed God to speak into it and had add his supernatural. There's been so many times uh, where we've been coming to um, an offering or a time of giving. And on paper, we've looked at what we could achieve in our own human ability, in our own natural strength. And we've sat and we've come up with a figure and said, that's what we can do. But then we always sit there and say, right, now add faith. Now let's invite the Holy Spirit into this and see what he can do through his power when he has adds his super to our natural. And so every time we sit there and we change what we're going to give and we believe in faith that God is going to come through. And we can say that every single time that we've done that, every time we've allowed the supernatural power of God to hit our natural, that he has come and he has brought breakthrough. There have been miracles and there's story upon story of how God has come through. And that is our prayer for you, that you would access the supernatural power of God. You know, as you run into 2023, that you will be called to operate in the supernatural, to allow the Holy Spirit to work in you and through you and see the environments around you be transformed. Whether it's the, the mum on the playground, whether it's a work colleague, whether it's a neighbour, whatever it is, you've got the power of the Holy Spirit in you to achieve the supernatural. And in Acts 2 verse 17, it says, in the last days, God says, I will pour out my spirit on all people. Your sons and daughters will prophesy. Your young men will see visions. Your old men will dream dreams. Even on my servants, both men and women, I will pour out my spirit in those days and they will prophesy. I will show wonders in the heavens above and signs on the earth below. You know, our prayer is that you would see the miraculous of God at work in your life. If you are young, if you are a kid, do not count yourselves out. And if you are old, I do not want you to write yourselves off because there's still dreams to be dreamt. There's still miracles to be had as we all access the power and the supernatural um, power of God. 
across our lives. As so church, we're believing for you that you will access supernatural, that across every campus, every location, every family, that it will be a year of breakthrough, that there will be miracles and that this will be your best, most supernatural year yet in the name of Jesus. So 2023, let's do this. Let's see the power of God transform our worlds. Love you so much, church, and I'll see you soon.